Hey, Liliana here at EDX Fitness, and this week's pro tip is about maximizing your time in the gym. And really what I'm talking about is minimizing your distractions. Now, I have definitely fallen prey to this, and I work from home, I work out at home, and so I get that there can be distractions and we actively have to remove them in order to really maximize our time in the gym. So there are a few things that I figured out that I want to share with you. And the first one is no phones allowed in the gym. Okay. I will check my email, my text messages, whatever I need to before my workout so that I have a clear mind. And then I will either leave my phone somewhere else. So I literally cannot touch it or I will turn it on airplane mode. Love that tip. Uh, or use it to play music so it's removed from my um, arm's distance, right? So now if you're using it to actually track your workouts during your workout, that's where the airplane mode might come in handy. Uh, but definitely do not check your messages. <laughs> that's a great time suck, right? Um, the next fitness hack is to use a clock. And really what I'm doing is I'm timing my rest intervals. So if I have three sets of a lift and I've got uh, a one minute rest prescribed between sets, I want to make sure that I'm sticking exactly to that one minute rest and not a minute 30, maybe two minutes or whatever, um, because eventually that will add up over the course of the workout to many minutes lost, especially if I'm trying to really get in and out of my workout pretty quickly or like as fast as possible, right? While still getting the full workout done. So you wanna make sure that you're timing your rests um, and using that clock to make sure that you're really getting uh, each amount of work done, right? The next fitness hack is to play your favorite music. Now, if you're in a gym, that might mean bringing along your earbuds and listening it to it that way. I love to crank my tunes really, really loud and my neighbors don't mind, um, but that really gets the stoke high because I can give myself that pump. Um, obviously, my favorite playlist is the EDX Jams playlist on Spotify. We play that here a lot at the Gala Garage Gym. Uh, but you know, whatever is going to get you super stoked so that you can really give your workout its all. And my last tip for you is to budget in five minutes at the end of each and every workout, no matter what, uh, for stretching. And I know a lot of people tend to skip the stretching part. Now we write in mobility for you at the end of each workout, right? So you don't have to guess about what stretch should I be doing? It's already there for you. But if you budget in those five minutes, try to get, you know, two to three stretches with like I'm holding each one for a minute. And what that's going to allow you to do is refocus your attention onto your body, kind of bring your energy level down and get you prepared mentally to go back into the rest of your day, right? Without that frantic, chaotic workout energy. So that's it for today. Those are your fitness hacks for the week and I'll talk to you next week.